Hello, everybody. And welcome back to XCOM 2. If whenever whenever it decides to pop up on the stream. <laughs> Any, any second now. Any minute now. No? Oh fuck, I gotta I gotta <laughs> I gotta res I forgot I had to re edit. I had to add it back on here. Hang on, wait a minute, hang on, technical difficulties. <laughs> uh that bam capture there it is. <laughs> XCOM 2. That's General Grievous. With a chainsword from Warhammer. <laughs> it's it's XCOM. It's, you know, that's just the classic. Everybody knows the part in XCOM where General Grievous with the chainsword cuts an alien in half and saves Earth. <laughs> from the alien invaders. Everybody, that's everybody's favorite part of XCOM. Uh, oh yeah, we were in the middle of a battle. Uh, and the game crashed a few times. Oh, wait, it, I think it just crashed again. <laughs> it just crashed again. Okay, well this time you guys get to see the whole intro sequence. Uh, it is going to take a few minutes to boot up. Uh, maybe we'll load, we'll load a different save. That one immediately crashed. It was like, no, that's not happening. So let's try a different, uh, the auto save before that one. And hopefully it doesn't keep crashing. And, uh, we'll give, we'll, we'll set up a... We'll set up a three strike system for XCOM 2 if it, if it crashes. Uh, if it crashes three more times, then, uh, there it is. If it crashes three more times, we'll just, just kill it. And we'll move on to Xenonauts, because I know Xenonauts does not crash this often. Uh, so we'll, let, we'll take it a little safer this time. And there's the Terminator. Everybody remembers the classic time in, in the XCOM mission where you, we have the Terminator with the chainsword. We'll load a different autosave this time. One that hopefully won't crash on, uh, on boot up. Uh, okay, here we are. Let's drop a manual save. There we go. Just just go ahead and manually save right there. Alright, what do we got here? Let's, uh, let's get this guy... Uh... What's that, Doc? Let's get this guy... Is this gonna be covered? Let's, put, let's just stick him over let's here. Let's go! So we have a bunch of aliens. There's a large group of civilians pinned down within range of your mm -hmm, position. Mm -hmm. Sensors indicate hostile forces are closing in fast. We need to get there before the aliens slaughter uh -huh. those people. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Okay. What? Are we fighting? Is wasn't there was there an enemy over here? Yeah, there's an enemy. Uh we have a person right here. Perfect. Okay, you can totally come over here and just blast this dude. I hope it's worth it. We can we're gonna put this dude on blast. 
Bam. Right in the face. The resistance team is in the clear. They're moving to help the other survivors. Alright. One group of people saved. Uh just don't crash game and we can do this. This guy bring him up here. No, he doesn't have enough movement. Oh wait, yes we can, yes we can. We'll put him right here. Up, 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 up. And take a shot. Oh hell yeah, we got the crit. Okay, sweet. Oh dude, this guy has rockets. He's our grenadier, dude. Ooh, if we could get a rocket. A rocket would be sick. We gotta be careful though, there are civilians and friendlies who don't want to blow any of them up with the uh, the tactical nuke-sized explosives we have in this. Uh, let's see, do we have a shot on that other enemy if we go anywhere? Unfortunately, it seems like the answer is no. But we can go up here, which seems like a really good spot. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, is there anybody else that has movement left? You do. So, let's... I guess we'll just have you pick up this Hurry equipment. Up. Grab that one. This is mine. And we'll grab that. While also putting you in cover. Alright. This guy... How far can you throw a grenade? Almost far enough. I think there's aliens right here, right? Let's just throw a grenade here and see what happens. There's probably aliens right there. Your white flag does not stop American bullets. There's an alien. Okay, so we were pretty close. We were just barely off, so we could throw us another grenade over there. It would probably hit this guy. Sweet. The, uh, the resistance is definitely putting up some resistance, that's for sure. Okay, that's still the same alien. I don't know how many aliens are over here. If there's multiple or just that one dude. Oh, 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 okay, we got another alien over here. <clears throat> Alright, let's first, first let's try this grenade. Let's just annihilate this building over here. Eliminate all their cover. Mech scout was killed, and an advent stun lancer was killed, so that's good. <clears throat> Uh, what does our cover look like right here? Uh, hopefully decent. Sending this guy far into the field. Okay, cool. We just see this one dude. Let's take him out. Excellent. Okay, he's down. Let's drop another manual save. Oh, I had to sneeze. Okay. Um, what is this? Carry unit? No, we're not going to pick up the uh, advent corpse. Let's see. I'll put you here. Help defend the, uh, the guys. We don't see any different aliens, but there is, a, there is an alien somewhere over here. Near that tree. Um... You might be able to get a shot. Let's put you right Who's here. Make it hard for them to flank you. Advent troops here. Okay, okay. What are you? What are you? What is that? What is this thing? An advent scout. Okay, the scout doesn't seem as dangerous as the stun lancer. Oh my god, we missed? Yeah, I didn't get it. Shit, okay. I don't think we've missed so far. That is not good. 
if we go here, we do have a shot if we go here. I don't know on what, but we have a shot on something. The scout? Okay, the scout's dead. That's good. Uh, we have a rocket. Our rocket guy. I wanted to shoot a rocket with him, but I don't think we should if it means we'll lose the corpse of the scout. Or this stun lancer. I think we want to get this intact if we can. Oh. That's not good. That's really bad. Rumors about some kind of shapeshifters. I'm guessing this is it. It is a remarkable species. If only we had some means of containing. Don't even think about it. Oh, and it regenerates HP. Oh my God. Holy sh. Shit, shoot it, shoot her, shoot her. Two damage, okay, that's good, actually, on this guy. Another two damage and another two damage. This guy will be in kill range for our guys. Assuming the resistance doesn't kill it. There are a lot of resistance soldiers, though, so let's see. has nine health now it's definitely in kill range <laughs> can these guys even crit or do they only ever do two damage I wonder based on how these guys are moving I think this is our last alien I think this little plus down next next to their rank here means that they have leveled up this battle. You haven't leveled up this battle, I guess. Let's see if we can get you a level up. That's badass. You secured the remaining civilians and there are no other hostile contacts on the scope. Good work out there. Hell yeah. We got Wedge, Mob, Solo, Duo. Yeah, we'll get the Wedge. Uh, I want I want him to have his minigun out. Where is he? Pointing suspicious hands on hip and th thumbs up. That's you. There it is. That's what we want. Okay, uh, and then let's get the... We could change location. That's pretty cool. Uh, what else do we got? Yeah, uh, yeah, we'll just keep that layout like that. Text. XCOM. Uh, humanity. Fight for humanity. Uh, filter effects. What is what is hide poster? Oh, we could just take a picture. I wish I could make the text larger. I know what we could do. X cob. Humanity. Fighting for humanity. There we go, that's better.
Let's make this the same color as that stripe. That looks good. Bam. We All right. must never doubt the depths to which our enemy will sink in their misguided beliefs. Today's cruel ambush of Advent outreach squads again proves that we can no longer tolerate XCOM. Firebrand. <clears throat> we really put a hurt on the aliens this time, Commander. They won't forget it. Oh, and nobody got wounded. That's awesome. Grants a free smoke grenade item. Sure. Once per turn, when the sharpshooter crits, they grant a crit chance buff to nearby allies. Cool. Oh, wait, you got a class as sharpshooter. You got a class as hacker man. Grants a free proximity mine. Sure, free proximity mine. Your grenades deal four more damage. Sweet. Uh, fire a shot that deals damage and inflicts various stat effects depending on the type of foe during jet shot. Uh, has a chance to instantly kill wounded enemies. Wow, that is really good. <clears throat> Take a reaction shot against any enemy that moves or attacks within a cone of fire. <clears throat> Gain an extra starting action point each turn, but lose six mobility. So you could do three actions? But you move less. Yeah, I mean... Doesn't that cancel out, though? Doesn't that mean you can move three times? Fog wall. Equipped smoke grenades have an additional charge to provide some defense. I mean, yeah. If we ever use smoke grenades, I never use smoke grenades in this game. Hammer shot. Heavy slug that knocks its victim back. Provides a random bonus to aim and crit chance for each mission. Sure. Two sharpshooters, a hacker, a slasher, and a blaster. 19 rescued civilians. Oh my god. We got all these different corpses. You have done an outstanding job leading the resistance, Commander. Commander. Some bonds. Let's bond some people. More bonds. Remember to buy your war bonds. What's this? Unstaffed engineer? Oh, Commander, yeah. Now that members of the resistance factions have joined us on the Avenger, I thought you might want an area where you can meet to organize and plan future operations together. Uh, Guerrilla Tactics School. You can put a rookie in here or not. Armory. <clears throat> XCOM Humanity Fighting for Humanity. Uh, let's see. Let's view our soldiers. We got this guy. This guy. This guy. This guy. This guy. This ship up and running, which was mostly Doctor Shen's work. I haven't felt particularly useful in a long time. I'm more than happy to leave the hard decisions to the commander. Oh, we have a sharpshooter now, so that's good. <laughs> what kind of uh, what kind of sharpshooter head could we give you? You can put you, give you some. Nah, that seems like too much. What if we just gave you a face with some hair. A face with some hair. What kind of hang on, What kind of uh? Oh wait, yeah, we have all these different camos for droids. Like, what if we got like Kashik? His camo ones, like the Kashik heavy, Kashik specialist droid. Commando droid, captain head. Uh, I don't 
let's see commando droid arms here we got a lot of halo and halo and other stuff but again we're saving that until we get like power armor oh god don't crash just on the customization screen dude there we go uh down here commando droid captain left arm we want commando droid captain commando droid left arm I don't see a commando droid captain arm so we'll just go with this uh, right arm legs yeah. commando droid legs there we go that looks pretty cool make the weapon black and the weapons already black perfect looking pretty spicy my dude <clears throat> this guy's a specialist uh, we can make you blue There we go. 13. Body. We got left arm. Uh, battle droid. What is that? Pilot, yeah. Officer. We'll get the pilot officer. Left arm. We'll get the pilot officer. Right arm. get the torso <laughs> cool and then we just need some legs bada bing bada boom Oh yeah, blue. And blue. Actually, can we match this blue? Oh yeah, there we go, that, that matches pretty good. Looking pretty solid right there. That looks cool. Uh, Let's give you a different voice. <clears throat> sure, <laughs> that works. Uh, I know we have some other people too, yeah. We got a battle droid. Uh, oh, we can make you the Geonosis, yeah. Head. Body, arms, pretty simple. Geonosis. Battle droid. Battle droid. Geonosis. Assault. Isn't his class literally called Assault? No, it's called Ranger, but... I'm pretty sure there's like a mod, or... If this is a mod that's calling it Ranger, then something else is Assault. Uh... Not pilot, Geonosis Assault, there we go. Torso. Oh wait, look at the look at the background. The background behind the the characters we're looking at. They have all the alien heads. I totally forgot that was a thing. It's the fucking faceless thing, the goopy monster. I can't believe I remembered it was called a faceless. But yeah. Creepy hanging up there. Uh, where is it? Geonosis assault legs. Nice, nice. Okay, weapon. I don't think any color is gonna match. 
what color this is for the droid here. Yeah, it's all going to be like slightly off, so we'll just go with uh, like a like a darker red. What do you think? Dark red or bright red? Let's go with bright red. Yeah. Also, we need to change your loadout to the chain sword. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, the other shotgun that we have available sucks, so... Okie dokie. Next guy... You... What other, like, customization options do we have? Like, if we go to, uh, instead of that, helmets. We can get Reaper stuff, we can get a couple different hats here. We could get some Advent helmet type things. Could get this one. That one looks kinda cool. Let's change his face to an actual face. I don't know, does the Andromedon look like too much? I think it might be too much for how little li how little we are, we have researched so far. Oh, you know what? I got it, I got it, I got it. Hockey mask. Do we have any crazy faces? Not really. Oh wait, yeah we do. We have the, the Terminator thing. <laughs> the hockey mask fits it perfectly, yeah. Uh, body. We're gonna mix and match some parts for this guy for the first time. So far we've been pretty by the book with everything, but I think we'll be able to mix and match something here. Oh, no, 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 don't crash, oh god. Uh, undersuit. Hero. Oh wow, that's a whole body. Uh, a central's torso. Padded Templar. Hmm. Oh, the padded Reaper. Now that looks pretty cool. And then for the arms, hang on, let's look at the arm sets that we have. Maybe that'll be easier. So we'll get rid of both the arms, and then we'll go to the arm sets. So we have like these boring basic human arms. We could get like the robot arm. Oh, but then this arm is kind of hollow still, so that might not work. Cybernetic arms, a little too, sh little too shiny advanced. The spokesman took a big risk getting inside Advent. Enough for me to believe he's loyal to our cause. There may still be a few skeptics in the movement, but we've got bigger things to worry about than a man on a screen. Hmm. Maybe that? Let's see what other options we have for arms before we finalize it on that. Ammo gauntlet, leather straps. What else do we have here? Some trooper stuff. Skip over the space marine stuff for now until we have 
better research done. But I definitely want to get some space marine armor set up because that shit looks super cool. Oh, here we go. We could do the commando droid arms. Those fit pretty good. We'll do... Commando droid left arm and right arm, maybe. Oh, dude, we could do super battle droid arms. It fits so good. Let's do super battle droid arms. How about that? I like it. Oh yeah, it like perf, just just barely fits onto the body. And then legs. What can we get for the legs? All kinds of stuff. So many options. Those are all the armors. Those legs actually, like, just barely might fit. I think that kind of works. This sort of just looks like it's the coat overhanging the front. Let's keep looking, though. <coughs> Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Let's skip past all that. We have the battle droid legs, we have the commando droid legs, those don't work. Some more super legs. Some classic XCOM. Oh, we could do Grieve. Mm. No, not really. Those, those, those. Yeah, okay, let's let's try that. Let's go back up to the top here. We'll go with this. Cause I don't I don't think there's super battle droid legs, are there? I maybe I skim past them, hang on. There are battle droid uh, but they're like way down here, so it doesn't work. Yeah, okay. So like, unless you really pay attention to it here, it looks pretty good, honestly. Uh, and then, let's see about changing some armor colors here. So we can go with uh, orange. Orange is my typical grenadier color, so. Orange is what I usually like to use whenever I can. Can we still give you hair? No, we can't. Yeah, none of this is going to change anything. Okay. Uh, orange. Orange, you glad? Uh, yes, and then we want to swamp, swamp out your grenade launcher for the rocket launcher. Because it's fucking cool. And we can have a rocket launcher and then just a bunch of rockets. Four rockets. Oh my god. Bam, 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 bam. Nothing can stop us. Uh, this guy's a sniper. Uh... How do I get the... I just realized. The... We can also do the... The, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, um... These guys. We just gotta make it work. <laughs> Yeah, not generic UK 
voice. We want a cooler voice. Um, what do we got? Death from above. Hmm. Pretty decent, pretty decent. Immediately. Barpo Cabalto. <laughs> the magic's all around me. Ah! Running on external power only. Core restart. Recommended. Uh I can do that. I'd like that. Now, don't you feel better? Under that placid Federation veneer, humans are still a bunch of violent savages. You're getting quite an education. Now, oh, let's be thankful for small favors. Oh, man, that's some pretty good options. Let's go with Odo. Uh, and let's pick a different attitude. Let's pick, uh... I'm sure, let's go with Intense. Now we can switch out the whole body, so arms, we want the arms. Oh, they're not here, I guess. Uh, we have to do them individually, so we'll get a left arm and a right arm. A left arm and a right arm. And a torso. We'll get the torso. Bada. Bing, bada, boom, and come on, scroll down, there we go, and the legs to match, uh, that, can we give you, oh yeah, we can give you some basic, basic armor. Arbiter armor, shins, arbiter. Hang on a second. Uh, torso gear. Here we go. Yeah, that looks cool. Uh, and then we have some. Shoulder armor, we probably want some shoulder armor. Arbiter. Oh, dude, this is badass. This is so cool. Uh, and head. We want to change the head. How do I give you a better face? Where's the... Ah, here it is. Okay, there's the face that we can change. All right. Bit of, bit of a lack of neck there. Uh... That's an interesting look. Oh, wait a minute. If we switch to the... Where is it? And you thought I'd talk too much, Commander. How about these Chosen, huh? EVA. Where is it? There it is. That one almost fits the whole <laughs> space in the gap there, but... Uh, Arbiter. That is cool. Does this change the elite skin armor? No. It must just be controlled in armor color. <laughs> so. Wait a minute. Is there like a arbiter torso then? Because that torso doesn't look like it lines up properly. 
There's Undersu and a big old gap. No, that's it. Okay. Am I crazy? It looks like it doesn't. Maybe it does line up and I'm just being dumb. I don't know. It looks, it looks off. Whatever. It's so hard to tell. It doesn't matter. Uh, you're still just a rookie. The Reaper guy. You, 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 you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's also make you a little bit taller. There we go. Okay. Do we want to... Oh, we can't even recruit people. Okay. So... Yeah. Commander, oh. we've got local resistance forces waiting to make contact, but we'll have to make the first move. Okay, let's make a resistance ring then. Which is now going to be built by our engineer, the one engineer that we have. Don't need supplies right at this second. The Avengers right here. Oh yeah, we were... We are not all that dissimilar, Commander. We have both lost, and in turn caused great loss for others. I shed blood in my master's name, just as you send others to shed blood in yours. There's a fine line between honor and hypocrisy. Got an urgent communication coming in for you now, Commander. You have made considerable progress against the aliens over the past month, Commander. I hope that your ongoing efforts will only lead to further success. Okay. Chosen are oh. a tough group to infiltrate, but we've managed to gather intel on their latest actions and have a rough idea of how close each is to reaching their ultimate goal of locating the Avenger. That sucks. Lowered, just permanently lowered our Commander, we income. Have intel suggesting the aliens are working on developments that threaten our ability to stop the Avatar project. We can conduct guerrilla operations to disrupt one of these efforts, but we'll have to choose carefully. We don't have the resources to intercede everywhere. Oh fuck, how do I stop that? Five weeks. We have received intel preparations to foil these dark events bef before they can be enacted are already underway. Counter operations will be available soon. Hey, Commander, the factions have pledged their support to XCOM, and they're ready to carry out your orders. As our influence with these groups increases, our capabilities will grow in kind. Okay, XCOM can tell people what to do every month. My people are up for some additional work if you've got any orders for us, Commander. Ooh. Recruiting your recruits are costly. Uh, let's get the all resources scanned are doubled. Raise influence through the ring. How do I do that? Commander. We'll need to send our own soldiers out to work with the resistance factions to complete these covert actions. They'll be gone for a few days, but this will help us build influence with the resistance while generating material support. Okay, well, let's send the, the rookie. How about that? Let's send the rookie away. Required soldier. They had to be sergeant and up. Um, I guess we just can't do that then. Rescue. Oh yeah, we want to rescue Mox. Yeah, so we'll send soldier reward more dodge. Sure. Yeah, we'll send the rookie to get the dodge, and we'll send Doctor Tiberius Sexbang. Uh, actually, let's send someone. Let's send the pyro. Someone who's a grenadier. Uh, confirm. I'll order my people to get underway immediately. Commander, the resistance has a hidden cache of resources stashed outside of Advent's reach, but that means we'll have to fly. Let's drop a save. I feel like we've done a lot. Okay. Uh, the resistance ring is still being built. Can I? Oh, I haven't even located the. The HQ is for the other factions. Okay, so we still need to do that. Another important step forward in our research. Commander, 
If we intend on discovering the purpose of the chip we extracted from it, we'll need to conduct the appropriate research as soon as possible. Best chance with, with the increased coverage, we can expect the efficiency of local resistance operations to improve, strengthening the groups working Commander, there. Okay. During the course of our research, we made a startling breakthrough that has led us to another potential avenue of study. However, if we are to proceed down this path, we must do so immediately. Sure, why not? I fear we will lose our opportunity to return to it in the future. I will send word as soon as we have something of note. Commander, we can now construct radio relays in any region where we've made contact with the local resistance. Okay, P facility. Commander, <laughs> the factions you have contacted are well equipped to track down the Chosen. Their knowledge will be invaluable in helping XCOM locate and eliminate these threats. We already have a covert operation underway, Commander. It will take some time to complete. Okay, so... Mm, can I build another resistance ring? Because if I can build multiple resistance rings, would that let me... Uh, you know, do multiple covert operations? Because that would be really useful. Debris cleared, let's view it. What do we... No, we can build resistance columns, which... Gives us increases the number of regions that we can make contact with. Further contacts can be gained. How many regions are we allowed to contact right now? We have 65 power, 2 out of 20. We can contact 25 places. Okay, so we don't need to worry about that then. Let's just keep excavating. Let's excavate everything and that'll give us the that'll give us a ton of supplies and let us build everything. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Laboratories increases the chance that a research breakthrough will occur. <clears throat> and we can put scientists here, which will decrease the time of all research projects. Okay. Workshops create unique gremlin drones, which can be sent to any staff room. Okay, I don't know why we'd want that. So I guess we probably just want to build some laboratories based on that information. But let's keep let's keep excavating first while we have the the, the time. While we're doing basically nothing else with our one engineer that we have right now, and we'll have all of this opened up for us, which will be very useful. <laughs> Very good, very good. Bam, excavate. Alright, alright. Keep doing this. Added. Investigate the Advent Black Site. Commander, okay. we've established contact with the local resistance, and we can move on the Advent Black Site on your order. We should make sure our troops are fully equipped and ready for a tough mission. I'm guessing security will be tight at the facility. Commander, I've updated our current objectives based on the most recent findings. Install... Radio relay cost 50 supplies. Oh, and it costs time to do. Okay, well, let's do the black site first. Since we're in the area, we may as well. Uh, let's see. What do we got available? Wait. Did it just have the pyro there? <clears throat> How many sharpshooters do we have? Can we do a full sharpshooter mission? No? Okay. Let's, let's take as many sharpshooters as we can, and then whatever slots we have left, we'll take rangers. Sharpshooter, 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 sharpshooter. We have five sharpshooters. And we'll take our lowest ranking ranger. One, two, three, four. I can't count. That's four sharpshooters. <laughs> uh, okay. Yeah, and I think everyone's loadout is as good as it's going to get because we don't have any fancy gadgets or anything at this early in the game. Let's go. 
Oh, we're gonna we're gonna have two squads. Oh my god. Okay, this is a goddamn operation we have going on. Uh, okay, so the second squad, whatever that's for, we'll take all of our rangers because the rangers are the funnest. Oh wait, the reaper is basically a sniper. Wait, 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 wait. Go back to the other squad. We'll bring the reaper. <coughs> there we go. That's basically all snipers. Uh, and then we'll get rid of all of you guys from this. Alright, and then this will be all of our rangers. All of our rangers. And we'll take our grenadiers with us. Yes, okay, cool. You probably don't need a Fulton extraction device. We'll give the Fulton to a ranger. There we go. All right. <clears throat> this is one crazy operation to be having two full squads going. What the hell are we going to be doing? I don't remember this mission being that crazy the last time I played this, but I played it a while ago, so I don't know. We'll see what happens, I guess. <laughs> Our contacts in the local resistance have shown us how to access the Advent Black Site. The aliens worked hard to keep this place under the radar, and we don't know what we're going to find in there. Keep your heads up. Expect heavy opposition. Confirm the black site is in your immediate vicinity. Infiltrate and investigate the area. Expect heavy resistance. Neutralize all hostile contacts. Prepare yourself. Okay, let's drop a manual save right at the start. Bam, manual save. Sweet. All right, since you have the lowest chance of being detected, we'll send you all the way over here not through the front door. We don't want to go through any doors. Not yet, anyways. All right. And here we go. All the way across the map. Oh my god. There is absolutely nothing so far. Still nothing. Oh, oh, oh. There's turrets. So many victims. Processed with such brutal efficiency. Test subjects for some sort of weapon, perhaps. Looks more like a refinery to me, Doctor. Once we get our hands on that sample, we'll know for sure. Never seen anything like that. Okay, yep. Take oh, care of wow. Those turrets. We're still not entirely sure if they're fully automated or remotely triggered. Wow. Uh, what is that thing? Oh my god, there's a lot of them. Okay. I think these cutscenes just triggered in reverse of what they're supposed to. Are we done? Looking around? Okay, I'm in control again. What the hell was this thing up here? There's there's some people up here. Let's let's send our guys on the rooftops. That seems like the smartest idea. Uh what are you gonna see? I'm curious. We got You're not revealed. But you do see this guy, so that's good. Uh, I don't see too much of a point on going this side. There might be a turret or something on this side of the roof, but besides that, not really much of a point to go this way. Maybe for better coverage. It'll be better if we if we have more people over on both sides so we can yes, potentially flank uh, the enemy. It's not likely to happen, but it could happen, depending on where they move. Uh, we only have four people? No, five. We have our Reaper, which is all the way in Satan's ass crack at the moment. And then we have our other four guys that we're still moving around. Uh, let's put you over here in full cover. And let's put you... over here in full cover. 
Yeah, we definitely want to be in full cover. Because a lot of shit is about to go down. We'll see where we stand with all of that movement. Okay, thank god you didn't get spotted. Uh, so we'll overwatch. Yeah, we'll just, we'll just overwatch all. Overwatch, overwatch. Oh god, here they come. They're patrolling. Now that one's an actual full-sized mech right there. The other one's just a robotic unit. So this is uh, a little scarier. Oh wow, okay, that's, that's a lot of dudes. That is a lot of dudes right there. Oh, and more. Moving through that door. Oh my god. <laughs> There's so many! <clears throat> um... Commander, I'm sending reinforcements in from the Avengers Reserves. Uh Oh dude, killing that side trooper would be so good. Um Okay, yeah, let's just let's just kill at least one of these guys. Take out this. And that should just reconceal us right there. Uh, ooh, reinforcements. Okay, yeah. A rocket launcher, that is some pretty good reinforcements. Thank you, Central. Uh, if we could just rocket this guy over here, or, or perhaps both the Sectoid and that Psy unit, that might be really good for us. So let's. Let's just dash you up here, which will get you in a really good spot for next turn to fire a rocket somewhere. You will put you in this corner, since now I know you won't be spotted if you go there. And... Wow, there is still so much map out there. Um, we'll put you on this corner. And is that everyone? No, you can still do something. So, let's put you in an even more awkward situation, in case you weren't already in an awkward situation. Put you here. To keep vision on as many enemies as possible. Yeah, let's put you here if we can. I'm sure there's a turret over there somewhere. Yes, sir. Just don't get spotted. It's it's fine. Just don't get randomly spotted by something. You heard the doctor. Secure that canister. Uh, I don't. I didn't hear the doctor say anything, but okay. What is this? Remote start. Detonate an environmental explosive, causing it to deal double damage within its within twice its normal radius. Does not reveal the Reaper. Wow, there's that. Uh, that. Nothing actually near an enemy. Okay, fantastic. <laughs> uh. Okay, it's just you three. All right, we'll just Overwatch for this turn. I have you covered. Are those? Oh, no. Immune to melee and does not trigger Overwatch. At the very least, you will die in honor. This is really bad. Heads up out there. It's the Elder's assassin, and she's moving into the AO.
Wow, you just made it really hard to fire a rocket at you. Oh my god, how far are you going? Okay, first I want to shoot a rocket launcher, because I haven't done that yet, and I'm getting antsy. This guy, with the rocket launcher. We want to blow up... Wait, does the rocket launcher only affect that much? Wow, that is a really tiny radius. But it does 4 to 7 damage. Let's put you... Here, I guess, is the best spot for firing a rocket. I have to be able to shoot it down this aisle. So, I have to be somewhere past these but I don't want to be vulnerable to everything okay well I guess we have to go here there's no other real good option okay good you're not spotted yet but you will be after this scatter there's a lot of scatter on that can we reduce the scatter at all no okay well don't miss Okay, you totally whiffed that shot. Uh, well that guy just set himself on fire. Oh boy. Okay, but that's... You didn't trigger literally every enemy on the map, so I think we're okay for now. Let's bring you over here. Oh, you can't take a shot yet? Oh, fuck. Let's kill the side trooper. Oh, wow, that sound hurt my ears. What the hell was that? Play game. What is that? That sound. That sound. Oh, my God. That sounds horrible. It's like louder than everything else. It's gotta be this guy. It is that guy's gun. That is so annoying. Uh, what is this? EMP grenade? Damage and disorient mechanical units. Can you throw an EMP grenade across the Grand Canyon? Oh wow, you actually can. It'll work, but it might trigger every single enemy on the map. Here we go. It worked. I think. It, it didn't disorient it, I don't think so anyways. Uh, what do you have a shot at? Not a good shot at that guy. But everybody over here already took a shot. So... Yeah, I guess you have to take the shot then. Don't miss, please. Okay. His annoying gun will now stop making noise. Now can you take out that turret? Yes, you can. Nice. Okay. Everyone, stay together. And everyone gets reconcealed. Nice. Um, are any enemies near a remote start type of deal? No, but we are. Cool. We can remote start that and blow up our own guy. We could throw a fr frag grenade down here. Fuck this whole area up. That could be viable. Probably want you to be in a better piece of cover though if we do that. So we are not totally gonna get rolled up on by a million advents. Uh, if we go here, these guys can just climb two ladders and shoot you in the back. But if we go here, they can do the same thing. Interesting. If we go here, Let's go here. 
Can we still get a frag grenade in here? Yes, we can. It's not a pretty shot, but it's a shot. Here we go. Oh, that's wonderful. Okay, that's two killed. And the robot's hopefully wounded. Man, that sectoid has so much health. These guys don't care at all, dude. They are like, I don't even know what's happening. Giant explosion, not my problem. The Chosen has appeared. And disappeared. And reappeared. Uh, okay, so... Okay, we can switch people with shift. You are still concealed? You are concealed. Okay, I thought you got revealed, but you did not, I guess. We gotta kill all of these enemies right here. Ideally, anyways. So, in order for you to have a shot, you would have to come down. Uh, okay, 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 hang on. I got it, I got it, I got it. We have a rocket launcher. Let's use it. And not whiff. Don't what? Don't whiff it this time. Don't whiff. Okay, good. They have, they have to move, and they're all wounded. I'm beginning to think the rocket launcher actually sucks really bad. Uh. Okay, we want to kill the sectoid for sure. So let's get some damage on him. He's hurting, but he's not dead. Let's, let's secure the kill on that sectoid. He's the most dangerous for sure. Uh, take out the scout. Nice. What is that big orange box? Advent Trooper. Bam. Done. That's a whole group of them wiped out. We can have you go collect the goodies, I guess. Now that it's totally safe around here. Get this. Get this. Alright. What are we gonna see here? What are we gonna see? Bunch of... Bunch of aliens inside right there. Okay, okay. We, I don't think we saw them before. Or maybe we saw them on the outside. There's the Chosen. Commander, I'm sending reinforcements in from the Avengers Reserves. Oh, well. We lost that loot. Oh, well. Uh, the shotgun, probably going to be good against the Elder. Yeah, let's get everyone... I think this is a good spot to get ready to fight the Elder, so... Let us not waste time. Let's get everyone nice and grouped up so Follow we can annihilate the Elder when they inevitably show up here. Oh, wait, we can also get this loot. That would be nice. Uh, can we get this loot without being spotted? I'm not entirely sure. If we go here, then yeah. Uh, can we go there without getting spotted? Yeah. Uh, we'll move you up a little bit. <clears throat> You can move up again, but I don't really see a point. Sure. So I guess we can grab this, since the other person didn't grab it. There we go. And then move you back. Okay, let's just, uh, that should be everyone moved up. Yep. Overwatch everyone who's left. And... Oh, we could hit that explosive right there. Uh, 
Uh, can our Reaper set that off without getting revealed? Remote start. That, 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 that. Nope. Apparently not. Uh, let's have you... People can walk through this hole in the wall here. Uh, but I'm pretty sure there's a giant mech right here somewhere. Patrolling this room. Yes, sir. What do we see in here? Can you remote start that? You, you can't, why? How do you not have a shot on it, dude? It's right there. Um, okay, let's move over here, I guess. Since I have no idea where that mech is. I really don't think we blew up the mech, because I don't think our grenades do 18 damage. I think they only do, like, 8 damage. Uh, we'll put this person here. 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 Here, we'll put this person here, and we'll put this person, uh, we want to keep everyone grouped up, so we want this chosen show up, we can actually help each other, just in case something bad happens. Yes. We'll just put you here. Okay, Overwatch, everybody. Hold your position. There's the mech. Is there still a turret up? I forgot about that second turret. Oh well. Where is this invisible person with the sword? Oh, I'm terrified, man. That person has a sword. I don't want to deal with it. You can shoot at it. Surely the Reaper can remote start that now. Yes. Wow. That is so good. It doesn't even reveal them. Nobody on our whole fucking thing is revealed. Oh, wait. We can see the Chosen? Where? Still just sitting there. Ominously. Did not move a muscle. Okay, let's put you there. Let's put you here. Let's get everybody in a position to take some shots at this freaking Chosen already. Let's put you there. Uh, I need you to get a shot, but I also don't want you to be revealed. There's a sectoid over there, so if I put you here, you might get revealed. We can probably safely put you here. Don't get revealed, don't get revealed, don't get revealed. Okay, you're good. This one... Put up here. Don't get revealed. Don't get revealed. Don't get revealed. Don't get revealed. Okay. What is this? Uh, where was that one ability? I saw someone had it. This thing, spray and pray. What does this do? Fire up to three different enemies, dealing 25% less damage. I don't think that's gonna let us shoot the same target three times. Trying to see if we can hit the Chosen multiple times without really moving, per se, something like that. Let us go. You can blue move up here, that'll be good. Still just a squad sight shot. Oh, you can't anyways, because you have a pistol, damn it. Uh, okay, well, let's, let, I guess, I guess we'll just take the shot, here we go with a pistol. Damn it, I forgot the snipers can only use their pistol after they move. Oh, but it still does good damage. Okay. You have to do better than that. Come down here. Or not. Or just stay up there. We'll shoot you either way. One can grow accustomed to pain. Wait, I have two options to shoot pistol? That's weird. <laughs> Where is your blaster now? 
I will not be deterred. Uh, I can't take a shot, but I can fire a rocket. I shall reduce it to ruin. This will reveal the shit out of you. If you're not already revealed. Did that hit them? I have no idea. Um... A proximity mine? Yeah, let's throw a proximity mine. That'll be good, actually. Then if it, if it turns invisible and moves, this should reveal it, right? We'll find out. You can't do anything. You can't even throw a grenade at it from here. So yeah, just go on Overwatch in case that sectoid comes back out. Oh fuck, I forgot it can make zombies, damn it. I should have killed it. It only has two health. That rat. Oh, these guys are patrolling into the battle. Or not. Okay, I think we're good gonna vanish and then move oh yeah it worked it worked did it kill it oh no okay it still has health I had hoped this is how we would meet on the field of battle your ideologies your resistance mean little to me the elders offer this world in exchange for you commander and I see no reason to delay the inevitable that's one of the chosen. Heads up, Commander. I'm sending reinforcements in from the reserves. I will give you a pin death. Let's go here so the other enemies can't flank you. And then we're gonna shoot this in the ass. That's a lot of damage. Uh, our reinforcements are... Not in a good spot. At least not in a good spot to help us anyways. Stunning strike. Melee strike and subdue us and uh, stun weakened enemies. Just that one. Damn, if you could stun the assassin that would have been cool. You can shoot the shooter. Shooter. We did it! Holy shit! Okay, can I... Okay. pains me to flee from a worthy adversary. The elders will not allow me to die in this world. We will meet again. Excellent work, Commander. We may not have put them down for good, but at the very least, we held off the Chosen for another day. We still- how do we not have a shot on that two health sectoid? What the fuck? This guy, what is he behind? not even like anywhere special dude he's just standing there do you have a shot from here on him I just gotta kill that sectoid and then the zombie will die there we go that's what I'm looking for all right okay is that everybody else done already no you still have a shot or not or you do uh, yeah, let's do some damage on the sectoid. The Psy Operative? I don't know what the Psy Operative can do yet, but the uh, we know what the sectoid can do, and the sectoid is very bad news bears for us. So, let's... Take the vial. Any readings? No signs of radioactivity. No significant energy signatures of any kind. Whatever it is, it's safe to handle. We've confirmed acquisition of the sample. Move to rendezvous at the extraction point. 
Is that enemies that are gonna spawn right at our extraction point? Because that's annoying. Hopefully kill this guy. Okay, yeah. That guy's dead. Now, can our Reaper kill this guy? We do have a shot pretty much anywhere. Let's see if we can have a shot from up here. Please don't miss. Okay. Good, good. Oh, uh, ooh. That guy's blue. What does he do? A riot trooper. Okay, well. He's not very good at handling riots, let alone a few operatives. Because he just chose to be flanked. Um, let's have you move. Oh, come on. I know you can move. Oh, that doesn't pick up the loot. Then I don't want to go there. I want the loot. Kill this guy. He took it like a champ. Just a million Gatling gun shots straight to the chest. Uh, you. Oh, dude, we can sword. We can finally use the sword. This is the opportunity to do it. You got spotted. Hell yeah. Uh, oh yeah, our reinforcements that got sent here at a really bad time. At least you can move over here. Can you still slash? You can totally slash. Go for it, dude. He's not having a good time anymore. Uh, let's put you right here. Alright, and just pistol shot. Bam! Who's dead now? Not me. Social damage? Social dynamo. Social damage. No. Alright, I want everybody to go in there at the same time, just in case anything funky happens. Okay, yep, just everybody else over watch for now. Stick together, team. The more you bring, the more we kill. That was a thing <laughs> that just happened. Uh, no idea what that was about. Uh, let's get you in here. Let's get you in in here. Everybody, follow me into the extraction. Uh, evac all. Avenger, this is Firebrand. Package is secure. All XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. Mission accomplished, Commander. We just hit Advent where it hurts. This was a place no living human being was ever intended to see. Happy as I am to see it gone. Something tells me the aliens won't take this lying down. Great job, Commander. We sent the Chosen back to their masters with a few scars to show for their effort. If they decide to face us again, we'll be ready. Uh... Why is the camera, like, off-center? There we go. Uh, 
uh, can we get like a wedge? Okay, yeah, it's it doesn't it's not very good. <laughs> Let's swap. Who's in the back here? Uh, the Reaper. Yeah, we need to put. No, 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 not that one. We need to put him in the back. No. What the fuck is happening? Why is everybody just disappearing? Okay, in the back. We need Jack Wright. No, not the front, not the front. The back. There we go. Uh, okay. Oeus, Tim, Jack, Alpentar. Layden and Elena. There we go, okay. Let's zoom in a little bit. <laughs> Layout Text. Advent. Wait, no. Advent. Exposed. No, the blue one. I want to change the blue. There we go. Uh, I don't want them all to be looking disappointed. That's cool. Where's Tim B1? Here we go. Uh, I always want. Yeah, there we go. Minigun. Alright. Epic. Commemorative photo done. That's why everybody's playtime in this game is so high, is because they just spend so much time customizing things. Advent officials remind citizens that spreading rumors of <laughs> At least we know these chosen can be killed. Well, temporarily. Deadeye, take a shot with small aim penalty for more damage. Fire your K3 pistol at a target. This attack does not cost an action. Yeah. What's this? Grants a free incendiary grenade. Why not? Grants a free frag grenade. Why not? Frag grenades are already free though. Um, balance HP with bond mate. Okay. Is this lightning reflexes? No. Reaction fire will only ever graze the sharpshooter. That's pretty useful. Any unit seen by a reaper remains permanently visible. Okay. I didn't know of any enemies that could become not visible again. Claymore does more damage and has more radius. Okay. 
I, I don't think I'll ever use their claymore still. The apparent product of the black site facility. I imagine it will take new objective added. Okay, a lot of are shit. relaying a form of encryption beyond anything we've ever encountered. This That's one less theorized. We'll have yep. to find a means of uh -huh. code. But I expect it will take some time. Uh retrain soldier abilities. No, we don't need to retrain soldier abilities. Let's improve bond. Oh, I guess we can't. Okay. Did anybody get like a new promotion? Yeah, okay, we can get squat size one, squat size four. Sweet. Resistance ring. We already have forces deployed on a covert action, Commander. We All won't right. be able to initiate another operation until the current one is complete. Okay. What is this? What's happening? Yep. You have my attention. Something is maybe about to happen. I can't do anything. I can alt tab out of the game and then tab back in. I can't I can't press escape. I can't even pull up the main menu. I can press the windows key. Uh, I can carefully spam every button on my keyboard so I don't accidentally end the stream. <laughs> I don't. I have no clue. I have no clue what the fuck just happened. Uh, it's stuck. I know that. I guess we have to... I guess we have to close it, because it's not... It just stopped working. <laughs> I hope it saved. I hope it auto saved. I made sure to make auto save super frequent if that's a setting. That or it's already super frequent, so it should have auto saved when we came back to the the ship, the uh, the Avengers or whatever whatever it's called. I don't know. It might be literally called the Avenger. Just gotta wait. Just, just give it a few minutes here. Let's go give it a few minutes. Just gotta give it a few minutes. It'll come back. It's coming back. It's loading. It's just taking a while. It'll pop up and it'll be really loud and shatter your eardrums. Don't worry. There it is. XCOM 2. With mods is not stable. <laughs> And it's likely to crash, Commander. I like that it puts your custom soldiers here. It's pretty cool. Is that is that the Avenger or whatever the dropship from the first game? That's cool looking. Uh, no, this is during the mission, but it's probably like one of the last. It's probably like the last turn of the mission, if I had to guess. That is a reaper. <laughs> oh wow, that was loud. Thanks for that. <laughs> that that just mm, shreds the eardrums real good. Uh, we'll have you pick up the loot. All right, and then we'll have you. Get on out of here. Everybody, get into the spot to get out of here. Carefully so I don't accidentally put them outside the dropship location. 
Okay. And evac all. Avenger, this is Firebrand. Package is Oh, do I have? I'm not. I'm not doing the poster again. I'm not. We're just not gonna have a fucking poster. Cool, cool. Continue. Just take us home. I'm not doing the fucking poster over again. I did it. It's done. Advent city centers are but one organism. When criminals such as XCOM strike against any single. Yep, At least we know skip. these chosen can be killed. All right, well, do this. Temporarily. This, this. Hopefully it's all the same upgrades. It looks like it. Is that the frag grenade? Yep. Uh, this, this, yeah, that's the bond mate one. Okay. This one. Oh, that's cool. The drop, you can watch the dropship go down in the background. I like it. It's a live menu. Alright, cool, done, now continue, continue, the continue, continue, uh-huh, okay, got it, improved bond, yep, we've ever that person, yep, Much less confirm, we'll have exit, find a means of escape, save, <laughs> dear god, save, okay. Are you gonna freeze again, or are you gonna do a thing? Cause if you're gonna freeze and be unplayable, I can't play you game. I can't play you. You're gonna make this really fucking difficult for me. <laughs> okay, let's 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 give it a few minutes. Let's wait here a few minutes and let's see if it does anything. Maybe it just needs some time, maybe it's calculating. Last time I waited about, I don't know, 30 seconds, maybe a minute. Let's give it, let's give it a couple minutes. Just wait it out. Might just be a little, a little hang up. Just a little hang up. Have some patience. But my patience wears thin pretty fast, so it better be like two minutes or I, I'm fucking out. Come on. Come on, game. Come on, game. It's there's only like ten mods that are fighting out out to be the top layer mod. It's totally fine. It's it's definitely not likely to cause any problems like this. Come on. Wamp 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 wamp. All right, I think we've waited one minute now. Spam some more buttons again, see if those do anything. Uh, none of those buttons, none of these buttons. Not caps lock, none of these buttons. None of these buttons. That, 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 that. That, 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 that. Uh, delete. And this, that, the other. How about this one? No. None of it does anything. Oh my god. Oh, dude, if it doesn't fucking do something, I'm gonna stop playing XCOM 2 because I'm tired of it crashing and I'm not gonna go through my mods and get rid of them. I'm not getting rid of my mods. Don't feel like it. Also, I will uninstall it and move it to the hidden category on my Steam library so that way I don't have to consider playing it again if it's gonna crash like this from my mods that I got for it. And it's been I think over two minutes now. Yeah, I think that's two minutes. Alright. Alright. Well, then, if that's the case, let's start our Xenonauts playthrough, boys. All right. <laughs> Who's ready to play some Xenonauts? It's only, like, a couple fucking months ahead of schedule. Um, but that's fucking annoying that it won't even boot up. Uh, that it, it just, it's just stuck. It's just... 
stuck. And I don't know why. It just goes whoosh. And you can't do anything. I'm trying to think now of what things in the menu we could do that could prevent this from happening if we reload it. If I reload it, I did say I'd give it three strikes. And when it got stuck on the screen, I would consider that two strikes. We'll give it one more chance. I did manually save, so we don't have to do the last turn, and we don't have to do all that jazz. So let's give it one more chance. Let's give XCOM 2 its last chance to not crash or get stuck. And if it crashes or gets stuck, then it's done. It's over. Let's see what it chooses its fate to be. Uh, and then we'll move on to Xenonauts. And I know Xenonauts is much more stable because I fucking have I fucking played Xenonauts. Xenonauts 2, I'm not going to have any mods for when we play that, so it definitely won't crash. And what do we have scheduled after Xenonauts 2? I don't even think I have anything scheduled for that slot after Xenonauts 2. Oh, wait, yeah, I do. XCOM, UFO Defense, and Stardew Valley. Huh. Oh yeah, because when we played UFO Defense, it just kept getting fucking stuck with the research. We couldn't get past the fucking research hurdle that we had in Xenonauts 2. Alright, let's get skip through all of this, blah blah blah. Take us to the main menu. Uh-huh. Come on. Uh-huh, yep, fancy intro sequence load. Escape, blah blah blah, load. There's General Grievous, funny joke. Loading. Let's try it. Let's try tabbing through our menus. Maybe there's something something that I have to look at. Something something happens. I have to trigger something in the menu besides the geoscape. Maybe that'll solve the the issue. Okay, here we are. We got a building. We got this thing doing things. We got these assholes that I can't improve the bond in because I did the thing already. For most of our soldiers, the living quarters on board the Avenger are a step up from the conditions they've had to live with on the ground. We have two scientists that aren't doing anything? Do they trip to research speed or anything? XCOM archives? Oh god. Avenger report? Power, minus one, armory, bar, memorial, bridge, commander's quarters, real tactics school, research, is 15, resistance ring, training center, uh, objectives, we've got different objectives here, completed, completed, that's our current one, um, our research is progressing as expected, commander. We did that. We scientists, yep. We could change our research, but I don't see the point in that right now, especially when we're only four days away from finishing this. I have to admit, there is something exciting about working under the more intense conditions found on the Avenger. Every God. decision, every development is of the utmost importance. There's no room for mistakes here. Hello, Commander. All the world is sorry for a bunch of. Are these those things from the old game, from the first game? I think that... Not this one, this one looks different. Scope, corpse, blah blah blah, all that stuff. Build facilities, build items, what can we build? Flashbang. Still nothing cool, absolutely nothing cool for engineering fine, to do. I'm hoping we find a few more recruits who can handle a wrench. I could use the help. 60 lost killed. One. Is that an officer or something? Uh. Customize the Sky Ranger. View our photos. Memorial. We've done what we can to honor our fallen soldiers, Commander. None yet. It's not much, but it gives our people a chance to pay their respects. 
I really don't want to click on that geoscape dude because I am so fucking I'm gonna be so bugged if it fucking if it crashes dude if it gets stuck again oh my god all right here we go Tactic school. A few soldiers. Yep. Command. Yeah, that is all that. That's everything, man. Don't get stuck. It's 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 broken. It's fucking busted. Oh my god. Fuck. <laughs> fucking hell. It's just busted, dude. Uh, yeah, let's just move on to Xenonauts. What are we playing first? Are we playing Xenonauts first or Xenonauts 2 first? Let's see. Uh, Xenonauts, yeah. So let's just, let me edit the panel on Twitch. We are no longer playing XCOM 2 on stream because I can't get my mods to work and I'm a big baby who needs my mods to make the game interesting. Uh... XCOM 2. Done. Let's get Xenonauts on the chopping block. <laughs> One of these alien defense, alien invasion type games, let me tell you, they're going to work. Also, let me rearrange these. So that's in the number one category. This is in the number two category. And this should be in the number three category. There we go. That Those changes should look better and make more sense now uh all right so the panels on the about section of the twitch channel are updated now and for this there is no hope left for you xcom 2 goodbye it was fun while it lasted it was very cool it was very funny when general grievous took out a warhammer chain sword and uh proceeded to chop an alien in half However, those days are now long behind us. So let's get rid of uh, XCOM Enemy Unknown, and we'll get rid of XCOM 2. Uh, da -da -da -da. Manage, hide, and uninstalling XCOM 2. Get it out of here. The base game, mwah, very staple but also not nearly as fun for me. With mods, way more fun, not nearly as stable. Okay, there we go, it's done uninstalling. Now let's boot up some Xenonauts. Uh, let's see. Modding tools, I have a bunch of mods on here. Uh, I'm not going to activate, I'm not going to touch the mods at all. We're just going to click play and hope it all works since, because I haven't touched any of the mods, it should work exactly the last way I played it. Oh, I should probably update the name of the stream and everything to uh, make it make sense. Uh, Vodkowski, Twitch channel, we'll go over here to the stream manager. And we'll update the information here. Xenonauts. Uh, modded Xenonauts. XCOM 2. XCOM 2 broke. Blasting. Blasting aliens. Bam. Xenonauts. And uh, most of the stuff we probably don't have to change. Probably just get rid of the XCOM tag, and that's about it. Oh, get rid of that. Uh, invasion. Uh, Xenonauts. Uh, rifle. Uh, explosive. Sure, done. Alright, and we'll go ahead and tab into Xenonauts 2. Yes, okay, so let's add that game as a source now. 
game capture add source add xeno knots as a source bam capture xeno knots close what where is it Well, there it is. Okay, yeah, okay. It shows up. Good. So, let's bring this down here. Put it into our game folder. Excellent. We'll get rid of you, sir. And we'll bring you up. Excellent. Okay, now we're playing Xenonauts. Please don't crash. <laughs> uh, we'll play... Fuck it. We're going to play on Veteran. No explanatory dialogues, please. I just want to get in here. Uh, yes. Uh, veteran, no explanatory dialogue. Begin. Select primary base location. The clicking sound will drive me fucking insane. I should get rid of that mod. Uh, let's get... What is it? Uh... Ah, central. That's the word I was looking for. Okay, we have central base. We have a base that we can build like this now. We have money. We have uh, living quarters with soldiers in them. How many soldiers do we have? We have eight. We need to hire soldiers. How many can we hire? Uh, if we click here, I need base stats. Here they are. Personnel capacity. Oh, we do not have a lot of capacity. Let's pick another living quarters. Please rotate. There we go. Uh, this is a workshop. This is a storeroom. Let's get another radar. And another radar. I can't put a radar down until the other one finishes. We do want a medical center so that people heal faster. Uh... Uh, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. I think we want a workshop. I don't know. I can't remember. Can we build another base right off the bat? Build new base. Yes, we can. Uh, let's build this base over here. I want it to cover, like, the whole Soviet onion here and most of Asia, okay. Yeah. Japan, there we go. We have a Japan base. That was like a million dollars. That was probably not the best immediate investment, but whatever. We can at least restart if anything goes wrong. We have a living quarters getting built. We have that. We have a hangar. I don't want to build a radar right here. I want to build it here in case we need this space up here. And what else do we, what can we build? We could build, what is this, a workshop? Yeah, I think we do want a extra workshop. It's so hard to, we'll wait, we'll just wait. I'm so eager to <laughs> just blow all of our cash for some reason. Uh, okay, let's see, this ship is full of people yes okay so let's rearrange the people a little bit and let's get them all equipped with my favorite class which is the shotgun because the shotgun blows people up really good uh we want smoke grenades up the wazoo because uh smoke grenades good because the aliens cannot see you at all uh and we'll bring we'll bring a couple of frags just in case there's some super crazy alien that I did not account for. Uh, smoke, frag, smoke, frag, smoke, frag, smoke, frag, smoke. Alright, we don't need spare ammo because I got spare ammo here. Da 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 da. Basic armor, you're good. Uh, now we'll set equipment as default and get rid of all these other shitty weapons that everybody has and give everyone the shotgun and we'll just blitz the fucking shit out of whatever aliens we find 
That's the way I play this game. Pretty different from my XCOM games, that's for sure. Just, if you see an enemy, fucking charge straight at it, put your shotgun in its mouth, and pull the fucking trigger, dude. That's how I play Xenonauts. Basically the polar opposite of how you play XCOM. Uh-huh. Bam, 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 bam. Okay, cool. And... Launch interceptors. We got an alien. Good. Kill, kill, kill. Oh, fuck. Can we find it? Yes! Those one. I want... I want you. UFO one. Kill, 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 kill. Auto resolve. Return to base. We have a crash landed site. Let's do it. All right. All right. We're getting into the action. Nice and easy. All right. We'll do something this stream. I promise. <laughs> we'll accomplish something. All right, these guys are positioned by the door so they can just do that and look around. Okay, we're in the top right corner, I think. What do we got? What do we got? Ugh, I don't like it. It's too open. It's really open. Let's see about this wall. Is this a good wall to be at? It's a, it's a good looking wall you got here. Sir. Oh, you can't get to that cover in time. Hopefully that's not going to be your last mistake in life. Alright, the front of our aircraft is secure. Let's bring you over. Man, these guys have shit time units. Uh, well, some of them do. This person has 67. That other guy had 45. Let's get you up here. Let's get you up here. all facing a direction that they can actually maybe see something. Alright, let's end our turn. Alien turn. Here we go. Oh, yep. You hear that? Gunfire. Alien. Spotted. Alright, what do we need to kill this guy? 27 or 19? Let's see if we can get the 27 for that bonus chance to hit. Oh, yeah. Fuck yeah. Now this is how you kill aliens. What do we got over here? A whole lot of nothing? What's in the fucking box? Nothing. Anything here? Anything here? Nope, no alien bastards around here. Alright, you're on a solo op now. We'll have you just go down here. And secure the back way. These guys will move around the front. Pop it open, here we go. Oh! Boom. Xeno down. Eat shit. Get fucked. Alright, what do we got in here? What do we got in here? A whole lot of nothing. Okay. And you don't have enough time units to catch up. Alright. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. You? What do you got? What do you what do you see? What do you see with your eyes? Your human 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 eyes. Nothing? Spin this way? Nothing. Uh, I'll get you over here. Alright, enter. That's a civilian. We're good. We don't want to blast them with the shotgun. Uh, but I would if it meant saving humanity. <laughs> Alright, there's a whole lot of nothing out here. So, let's keep walking you around. Do we see anything else in this courtyard? No. It doesn't look like it, at least. Around the corner here? Inside the building, perhaps. Not hiding in this corner. These two guys didn't get shot at or anything. Oh, well. Now we gotta walk around, because this area is closed in, so... Uh huh. And you can just keep walking. Nothing. Absolutely nothing out here. 
And you are way out here, ex totally exposed. Oh, fuck. Yeah, you're not going to be able to take a shot at that guy. Oh, well, you can. That's a hit. Um, but it's definitely not to kill. Can we throw a grenade? How much is it to throw a grenade? You need 33 time units and you have to be basically right next to them. Okay, so let's see. That's not 33 and it's definitely not close enough to throw a smoke grenade. Well done. You, my good man, might be fucked. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Can you throw a smoke grenade on our guy over here to save his life? 41 to throw. 41 to throw. It's not looking good. I'm gonna be honest, it's not looking good. Uh, we can at least throw a smoke grenade here, which will make it harder for him to see. Let's try that. Okay. That works. This game has such bad audio balancing. Uh, sound effects. Let's bring the sound effects. Wait. Oh, that's music. That's music. This is sound effects. Okay. Let's make the sound effects not pierce my eardrums every time anything happens. Alright. He's not going to take any shots. We're good. Sweet. I think it worked. I just want to check this corner here that we haven't looked at, because you never know what these aliens might be up to. Wow. No time units. This is a, the beginning of the Xenonauts. A little rough. A little rough. Not, not terrible, though. Not terrible. Alright, let's move you here. You can see him. Can't take the shot yet. You, I don't know how many time units you need to take the shot, but you can't take the shot. And we also can't see their little dirty alien airship. That's it. That's probably it. That looks like a crash site right there. Uh, ooh, can you take a shot? You need 17 to shoot. You can't take a shot, but if we put you here. We found the alien craft. Crouch. And you can probably blast the alien if it walks around that corner. You might be able to reaction fire him. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, let's get you around here. Go ahead, you alien bastard. Take some shots. I fucking dare you. We'll fight to the last man. That I can promise you. Oh, that, that's bad. Oh, okay. Well, we did lose someone. Oh, that guy was a sergeant? Holy shit. Oh, what the fuck was that shot? Oh, that's bullshit. Oh, you alien motherfucker. Damn, dude. We lost two people in one turn. Fuck. Uh, how many shots do you need to shoot this thing? Four, you need 14 time units. Okay. There. Alright, we got that one. Now, who the fuck just killed my other guy? You rat bastard, where are you? Oh my god, you need so many time units to throw a fucking grenade in this. 33. Alright, let's get you up here. We'll just throw another smoke grenade. Oh, it's 39. I'm fucking dysle dyslexic, dude. All right, let's try this again. That is 42. <laughs> Almost all of your time units to throw a fucking grenade. Okay, 42. Yes, then the value has not changed. Throw it right there, please. Okay, good. He's in the smoke, so he's covered. Uh, let's get everybody in the smoke that can get in the smoke. Let's get you in the smoke. Because if you're in the smoke, the aliens have a much harder time hitting you. Oh god. Okay, you're not dead. You're not dead. That's huge. <clears throat> oh fuck, I didn't bring medkits. Oh, he's gonna bleed out. Fuck. 
Oh, and he's suppressed, so we can't even get up there to kill the alien that just suppressed him. For fuck's sake, dude. I hate the suppression mechanic in this game. It's so bullshit. Uh, you need how many time units to throw this fucking thing? 42. Go here. 42. Let's throw it there. Alright. You need 32. You need for oh fuck it. I'm I'm not gonna throw another goddamn smoke grenade, dude. There's plenty of smoke, don't die. I really don't want these fucking aliens to be able to suppress multiple of my guys again, because that hurts so bad. Suppression in this game is so overpowered. Oh, oh okay, you only took one shot. We're good. This guy, yeah, he's dead. I get that, yeah. <laughs> he's dead. That's three units dead. But if we finish the, the mission fast enough, we might be able to save those guys. So, open the door. Shoot him. Okay, you can't spin around and shoot this guy, but that's okay. You have teammates here to do that. Stand in the smoke. Shoot him. Okay, <sighs> alright. Oh, nope, they're all dead. They're just dead. Boom, dead. Fuck. That is brutal. Alright, well, at least we got some shit to research. Uh, This place. Wow, we only had 10 scientists? Lab space, 5 out of 15. We only get 5 more. Damn. Oh, we can totally afford to get some more, though. Okay. What can we... Hang on, what can we build? Nothing. We have nothing to build. Okay, so there's no point in hiring more engineers. We should definitely hire as many soldiers as we can, because we are going to lose a lot. Uh, sort by time units, please. Hire that guy. That guy. That guy. That guy. Nope, we're out of living space. We must acquire more Lebensraum. Alright, bring our boys home. Alien invasion researched. High speed interceptor? No, we want alien alloys so we, we don't die as fast. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Yeah, 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 aliens. They're spooky. Oh, wait, it takes time for the, for the things to get here when we order them. Yep, there's a big alien. He's ugly. Funny looking. Alien craft? Not very stylish. We make cooler things than that. I've seen Lamborghinis cooler than that thing. Alright, there's all of our junk up in our trunk. So let's slap those on there. Okay, so that'll speed up our research a lot. All this shit going off is a bunch of UFOs and I can't see them and it sucks. Living quarters. Complete. Okay. How many more people can we fit now? Uh, 35 more? It's decent. It's a decent number. We'll hire a couple more soldiers. 62, 61. Please, I need more time units. No, no, they're running out of time units. Uh, alright, let's get more HP then. Who has the most HP? You. You. You, nobody has 60 time units yet. You. Okay. How about strength? This guy has a lot of strength. Uh, uh, okay, let's go back to HP again. Oh, thank God, it's almost 63 time units. Okay. All right, that's enough soldiers for now. Can we get more scientists? No. Damn. Can we build a laboratory to research things faster? How fast is this going to be? Oh, it doesn't tell us. Okay. Yeah, let's build another lab so we can research faster. I have no idea how long that thing that we're doing is going to take. Uh, we'll put a garage here so I can put another radar here. Eight. 
Alien alloy is done. Oh, that doesn't let us build anything. Cool. I didn't want better armor anyways. Yeah, we just can't build up. Okay. Alright, we got some soldiers. Cool. A small UFO. Let's shoot her down. And our soldiers. You guys need to carry med, med kits. So that's what we realized from last time. Wait. Wounded? I don't think anybody that got wounded lived last time. I guess I was wrong. Uh, we need a med kit. Yes. Med kits are the one thing I forgot about. So we'll put ammo in the backpack. <clears throat> now I remember why I used to have ammo in the backpack all the time. Because you want to put your smoke grenades here. And keep your med kit in your offhand like that. There we go. Uh, What is this? Incendiary? Yeah, that's useless. Smoke. Frag. Smoke frag. We don't even want frag grenades, really. We probably want a C4 charge. It only does incendiary, but it does suppress... 65 incendiary. This does kinetic, but it also suppresses. Yeah, we'll just, we'll just do the frag grenade thing. You usually don't have to reload in this, um, from my experience anyways. At least for quite a while you don't have to reload. Uh, wow, you can carry even more grenades? Jesus Christ. Uh, equip default, blam, 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 we don't want them to carry too much, there we go. Rifleman. Assault. And we'll throw you on the ship. But um tish. We'll throw actually let's just change what the rifleman role is. You'll just have the rifleman just a heavy machine gun. There you go. That's your rifle. There's your fucking ammo. And yeah. Just in case shit hits the fan, that's that's what you'll have instead. If we have to defend the base for some reason. And we'll set that equipment as default. Alright. Get rid of those. Switch roll to assault. Bam, bam, bam. Throw you on the ship. Switch roll to assault. Bam, 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 bam. Bam, we got the gap for the splat on the alien. We blast aliens around here, sir. Bam, bam, bam. All right. Everybody has the assault with the med kit. Yes, we don't really have anything else up our sleeve right now, so that's good. We'll shoot this down. Bam. We'll wait for it to become daytime, and then we'll attack. Come on. There we go. Engage. Good luck, Commander. Right click on a target to spend additional... Oh, okay. Oh, I forgot to rearrange for my guys. Alright, well, just go ahead and spin around. You don't see anything? That's good enough for me. Do you see anything around this building? No. Okay. What do we got around here? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. This is going to be filled with aliens. I just have the strongest feeling. I got the strongest spidey sense about this place. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Nothing. Uh, wow, you can barely fucking move, dude. Just have you right there, facing that way. Uh, can we get you against the wall? No. I really don't like them to be out in the open. Can you move over? You can move over, okay. So you can fit at least one more person next to you. That should be good, okay. We'll send a couple more people this way in case there's aliens over here. 
Bada bing, bada boom. Here comes your fucking doom. Alright, nothing so far. And this person. Let's, let's put you here in the in-between area. And hopefully you don't get the shit shot out of you through like this window or something. Oh, oh fuck! Oh god damn it, it suppressed my guys on the other side of the wall. Fuck. That happened to me in Xenonauts 2 recently. I really wish that wasn't a fucking thing. Oh, okay, we got big lizard dudes. Also, there's the ship, so we want to go that way. We'll rush towards the ship. Uh, yeah, okay, we see this guy now. Well, at least there's less likely to be an alien in this warehouse. But we can use the warehouse to get to the side of this air of this craft without having to go straight towards the front door, which is really dangerous, as we learned last time. Face that way. Let's just rush the craft. The aliens will come out of hiding once we clear the, the guys out that are in the, the spacecraft. At least I think so. They might not. But let's attempt it. Let's make an attempt. Uh, Alright, go there. You. Uh, you can... Yeah, we'll just bring you over here. Uh, you, you can go the other side, actually, and potentially flank this alien as soon, as long as he doesn't see you anyways. Uh, and as long as there's no other alien right here that's going to come around and shoot you right in the face. Okay, they're in the warehouse now. Well, that thing that I said did not happen to you, so... You are totally safe, maybe. Put you there, that's your turn done. Let's open the door, there's an alien. We need 18 to kill him. Uh, why is that a question mark? Oh, because you have to go this way. 18 to kill. He's totally alive, he is well and healthy. His, oh shit, is that two aliens? Did a different alien just take a pot shot? No, 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 stop! Okay, you bet barely enough time units. Okay, there is totally another alien right outside here. Uh, can we... Oh my fucking god, there's a guy there? Holy shit, our guy was just here last time. And the turn before, he was like right here. Oh fuck, that's not good. If he shoots this, it'll blow up. Uh-oh. We know there's an alien over here. So we gotta deal with the one right next to us. Oh, fuck. We could spin around and try to hit this guy. You need 23 time units to shoot this thing. Goddamn. 27, so you could crouch for maybe an aim bonus. Oh, yeah, you're in a real bad spot, friend. Oh, 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 wait, but we can throw a smoke grenade on you, give you some cover. That'll be awesome. Yes. I need to relearn the smoke, smoke grenade strategy. Because it was super valuable. Uh, how many time do you need to throw this? 32. You can barely walk around a couple boxes, dude. Um, I guess we'll get you in this warehouse as well. In case our guys get suppressed again. Alright, they probably are going to get suppressed, so... Let's get as many people in here as we can. So that way we can rush this other alien. Alright, everybody, except for you, has spent all your time units. But you're going to be here, so when that alien comes here, you'll shoot him on reaction fire. I hope... Oh, you fucker! He just walked right up to us and... Well, that, that plan worked, but he's not dead, and that person's going to run. That's not good. Okay, well, can you take another shot? Excellent. Excellent work. Someone around here is capable. Uh, you need 
20 to take an aimed shot. Oh, fuck. Can you take a regular shot for 14? Eey, I don't like these odds. Okay. Okay, well, you didn't hit the giant explosive thing two feet away from you, so you're, you're good on that front. Now, 21. We can sandwich this guy. Oh, dude, let's fucking... Boom, right in his mouth. Bam! Excellent. All right. You are very exposed, my friend. Uh, okay, we'll step into the smoke at least. Can you crouch? Yeah, crouch, step into the smoke, whatever you can. Any tiny little bonuses to not getting hit, we will take those. Okay. We call those a dub where I come from. All right, get over there. We call those a dub where I come from. You are the person that ran away. And I ran. I ran so far away. Oh god, we got two at in there. At least two. Uh... Go, 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 gadget. Get the fuck ready to blast some aliens. You go here. You drop your gun, so you may as well just fucking heal yourself. You... Ass clown. Excellent. Put that there. And go grab your gun. Again, you ass clown. Everybody else, uh, get ready to breach. We're gonna storm the fucking castle here. In there. You see anybody behind you? Nope, so. Ooh, you can't safely get around that corner, so we'll wait on that. We'll get you there. How about you? Can you get over here? You can. Alright, that's good. Get you over here. Switch over to this. Can you just drop that at your feet? No. Um, yeah, I think that's all we want to do this turn. We'll wait. Okay, they didn't come around the corner. So, this is our turn to react to them and shoot them in the face. Well, fuck, now you're blocking the way, okay? Okay, cool, that's alright, that's alright, don't worry, don't worry. Let's go here, take him out. And that's the end of the mission. God damn it, that person died again. Yeah, Erin Renaud. So did you actually die? Because it said you died. Yeah, I think they're gone. Yeah, I don't see a Renaud here. Oh wait, I see a Renaud, but it's uh, someone else, Raphael. Any relation? We'll take you off, we'll throw you on. And we'll throw Renaud on here. He's got a family vengeance now. You killed my sister. The alien bastards took my sister. I'm here for a vengeance. I'm gonna take every single one of them down with me. Alright. All that good. Oh, we should totally save. Great. Okay. Oh. Small. Boom, boom. Launch. All right, we'll wait until the morning. Radar array, medical center, command center. Oh, command center for Japan, done. Okay, what I usually do with these bases is I usually build a million missile defenses so they don't get attacked very easily anyways. Missile batteries. Those are 50,000 each. What about a hangar? 25,000 so we can build couple of hangers here, there, everywhere. Okay. What do we got in the storerooms here? Alien alloys. Five? That's it? That's it? What the fuck happened to everything? We did, we did two missions. We got a bunch of alien dead bodies. Where are they? What the fuck happened to all of our shit? 
We only have five alien alloys, dude? What the fuck? That's nothing. What are we supposed to do? Oh wait, before I launch that dropship, I need to move someone to this side. Yeah. Sidewinder, autocannon, yeah, okay. Let's... Wait a minute. Hang on. Are my mods working? I thought I... I thought I played this... Or maybe it was when I played Xenonauts 2 by myself that I had, like, other weapons I could throw on these. I think it was... Never mind. I think it was Xenonauts 2. Okay, let's just send a ship to this dropship going in. Engage. Damn, dude. We have no, no alien alloys? We need that shit. We need alien shit to make better shit. Dog. Nothing here. What do we got here? Nothing. Nothing. Okay. Well, I'm gonna save it here. Because technically... We did do a full stream, uh, but next stream will be an actual full stream of just XCOM 2, not, or not XCOM 2, but Xenonauts. It'll be a full stream of Xenonauts, not XCOM 2 crashing followed by just Xenonauts. So we'll go ahead and quit for now, and we'll come back to uh, a game that works. A game that works it seems to work I don't know if any of my mods are working in fact let me let me check uh, if we look at the launcher what what mods does it have listed here uh, furies terror and dreadnoughts oh my armored assault uh, XCOM vehicles swamp stuff tile set tile set lore plus new cars more variants of cars to towns Maps, alien base booster, uh, different, which is just different bases, another map pack, another map pack, another map pack, uh, descriptions, balance adjustments, settings, that enable further improvements uh, with this mod, or gets closely to the original game. This mod does not provide any balance adjustments. Use of this mod is strongly recommended. Wait a minute. Do I have... <laughs> Have I just been playing a fucking... Did I just start a, din a vanilla... A vanilla Xenonauts thing with no actual mods that change anything? Son of a bitch. <laughs> we might have to just restart. So I can actually get a mod. That does anything. None of these mods, like, actually do anything huge. Ooh, wait, what's the Xenonauts fix pack? Mapping tile errors, graphical bugs, misfeeling, miss bugs. I don't even think I have my... What is this? Armor Assault, Aegis Armor? That's in French. Uh, un, deux, nouvelle, armée, euh, traduit... Uh, anonymous mod or placer it is de a it is sus 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 very sus okay maybe maybe I need to add some mods uh bar, 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 bar. 1980s GDP and militancy. That is a. What is this mod? Oh. Oh, wait a minute. When I click on view my subscriptions, it says I have nothing. <laughs> that would explain it. Okay, so we're gonna have to restart Xenonauts. That's infuriating. Uh. Okay, yeah, that, that, I hate that mod, it's too difficult. 
barley troops minimum stats from 35 to 45 random map pack uh, just let me see all the mods uh, last updated small immersion changes changes some of the portraits of the soldiers edits some things I don't know why you would need to do that. Xenonauts Drone Warfare. Ooh, first mod. Requires Community Edition. Uh, this mod does not allow Xenonaut forces to use drones of their own. What this mod does do is add drone exclusive variants for almost every alien ship. I fucking hate drones in this game. I will not be getting that mod, which just adds more drones. Yes, lasers and plasma may be fashionable, but I'd rather take Eugene Stoner's masterpiece. Recently played the game for the first time in several years and was uh, suddenly motivated to make a mod again. I previously made a mod with the same title here, and this is a reworking of it. Uh... I guess this adds new guns, but basic concept adds ballistic weapons to replace lasers, plasma, and stuff, but in working on the new one, I've added a few features that serve some testing. Research is required to make sure it's not busted. Swap them around so the old mod guns are replaced by the M16 vanilla. Blah, 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 blah. Gold Hawk operatives. Another armor icon. Change the icon on the ballistic wolf armor to one that references the style of the of a real life soldier. What? No. Lighter grenades. Ooh. Oh, hey. Grenades do not weigh one kilogram in real life. This mod fixes that by reducing the weight of all grenades to 0.5 kilograms. This will probably upset the game balance slightly. Nice, nice. Screw metal gas, like the metal's being released right now. Uh, if you plan on making weight mods for other items. Uh, also, for some reason, did not show up. I like still these are FLX cool. Maybe go from there. Interesting, I like that today. Well, that was in the. Uh, 2022 and they said they would look at it and I don't think they have looked at it UFO extraterrestrials music I don't know what that is uh, what is this 46 it's yeah, okay it's something dumb F-104 starfighter Uh, it's a single-engine supersonic interceptor aircraft. It was developed into an all-weather, multi-role aircraft in the early 1960s. In this universe, the Starfighter is a cheap early interceptor with limited range, but a wider weapon loadout than the Condor. Ooh, okay, okay, here we go. A mod that actually does something significant? Uh, not really. It just, it adds one slot for the torpedo. That is it. It adds a slot for a torpedo, and that's it. Um, essentially, the first adapted and interceptor by the Xenonauts when the unit was first stood up at the Iceland incident. A standalone mod that works well with the community edition. I have no idea of compatibility. Try to make this mod useful for the early game. So no mods are working, you say, so no option to buy. Are you using the community mod? Does that not work? Hey dude, I hope you're online. I'm very interested in playing this mod, but having an issue on my game. I don't think any of my mods are working. Let's use using guinea pigs since we get an option of to start the game not seeing it. Only the condors, what do you think? I'm trying to yes, I know I started when I installed this mod and it was fixed, but I disabled it. Sorry, man, it's on my I don't know. <coughs> 
blah 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 blah. Is there anything that adds anything cool that actually changes, that adds like a new weapon or a uh, new armor? What is this? This mod has the ability to upgrade the existing tier 1 ballistic weapons with researchable attachments. Ooh, magazine capacity. Interesting. A higher magazine capacity shotgun would be sweet. Uh, I don't know. Mag weapon images, energy weapon images. Uh, bigger pool. No, people really just don't make a lot of fucking mods for Xenonauts, at least on the workshop. There's probably a bunch on the mod nexus. Let me look on the mod nexus. Nexus mods. Uh, search for Xenonauts. Uh-huh. Uh. Yep, this is it. Where is, uh, Games Xeno? Is there literally no? Ah, there it is. Okay. Hopefully it's actually got some mods, not like the Steam Workshop where there's basically nothing. Explore all mods. Sort by... Da -da 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 -da. Last updated... Uh, Polska Wurzja. That's that's one I didn't see on the other one. Uh, let's see. We got all the same things. Uh, oh no, that just replaces the textures of some things. That replaces the main menu texture. Uh, wow, I I thought I remember there being some more things for this game. What the fuck? It looks like this mod just adds a, a million more cities. Added so many more cities and countries. An additional zoom later. Okay. Uh. Sounds. Uh. Here we go. Expansion pack. New UFOs. Sweet. Okay. Vehicles. Graphics. New aliens. That thing is horrifying, whatever that is. Aircraft, new aircraft, that's great because there's like no fucking aircraft in Xenonauts. You have, you have, in Xenonauts, you have the, the aircraft that you use when you have like ballistics and laser weapons, then you get the next interceptor that you have to use, and then you get the final interceptor that you have to use. And there is no deviating, and if you deviate, you die. That's it. There's basically nothing else. Ooh, this mod adds new weapons as well? Holy shit. What does this require? Oh, uh, oh wait. I think I have that. Xenonauts Community Edition. I have that. We want a vanilla experience but with some new additions and changes. I'm not looking for technically a vanilla experience. I want more, and I really don't want to play the fucking X Division mod, because it's just difficult, and that's not fun. It's just, here's a bunch of bullshit. Losing is fun, right? There's, the, there's that one thing. Uh...
basic 90. Also, line of sight. Okay, yeah. Uh, I guess I just forgot to reinstall these mods that I used to have. There's that. Flamer. I don't. I just use shotguns, dude. Honestly, just don't forget to bring a shotgun. What is this mod? I highly recommend using. Uh, it replaces stock carbines. I didn't even realize carbines were a stock thing. Ballistic shotgun. Scatter laser. 12 pellets. 9 pellets. 10 rays. 10 rounds. Mag... Why did the mag gun get censored? I don't know. Damage equals 30 times 10. Uh, mag cannon. You might get a device you dislike or love to death too much to fire at solar aliens. Scar, scatter, laser, and aviation. Probably not. Possibility of what to kill. Prism laser? I don't know. It replaces stock carbines. Original scatter laser. It, I, uh, I don't know. Let's sure. Let's get that mod. I don't know what it does exactly, but it's something about shotguns. Uh, all alien psi attacks are less effective. It costs more for aliens to spam their psi attacks. Yes, that'll be good. Jackal Armor Profit. Making money out of the earliest manufacturable commodity, which does not have any special requirements. Sure. Provide one single hassle-free thing. The Horde. Adds a variety of aliens of different races into it, and aliens they already ground for us. In a small UFO, there are still only 10 aliens? That was in. This guy said he'll look into it in 2020. Did it get updated in 2020? No. No, it did not. <laughs> it was it was last updated in 2015. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, let's see. Larger living quarters. Yes. That's what I need in my life. Uh, instead of 35. 40 instead of 35 for living quarters. Nice. I just changed the HTML to 999 personnel. No way. Can you just mod the files for Xenonauts? Because that would be so much easier. Um, if we go to the game file, and we go to... Uh, you know, I'll, I'll end the stream now. This is all just me rambling. Um, but yeah, I'll, I'll be back later. Tomorrow, though, we're going to play more Enlisted, which I'm very excited to play. And, um, but yeah, I'm going to look at mods. I'm going to mod the game a bunch, but I'm not going to break it. I'm going to get just a few things that mod it, and then I'll probably modify some base game files. And that's it. That just changed some values. Uh, but yeah, check out the About section of the Twitch channel. It's got all the information you need to know about the channel. Uh, we're playing Xenonauts now because XCOM 2 wasn't working. We have Enlisted tomorrow, and then after tomorrow we have Oblivion. Um, I might play more Spore tomorrow randomly. Uh, I just Spore is on sale right now on Steam, so I was like, you know what, fuck it, dude, I gotta get that. It's on sale, dude. So, yeah.
go ahead and get it. It's pretty cheap right now. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. Love you. Bye-bye.